This is VNN. It is 722, and we know what we do every Monday morning at this time. Cue the music. Rohan, Rohan. All right. We got to get it straight from the Rohan's mouth. The director of recreation and parks here in the villages. With the Parks and Rex Report, it's John Rohan. Good morning, John. Good morning, Jack. How are you? D, how are you? Very good. Weekend good? Weekend was really, really good. You know but what I forgot to do last Monday? Mm-hmm. And I did it on May. Was Wish people a happy New Year? Father's Day. <laughs> oh, Father's Day. <laughs> yeah. <You're> so close. <laughs> yeah, so I hope everybody had a great Father's Day out there. Um, I have two... They're not children, uh, adults now, but uh, they came and hang, hang out with me uh, oh, yesterday, cool. so it was a great Father's They're Day. always going to be your children. Yeah. For, forever, yeah. man. Yeah. It's so, just the way um, it goes. Great, great Sunday, and just count your blessings. It was good stuff, and having them around. So, a great picture on the front page of the uh, rec publication of three generations that came out and yeah. fished on the Lake Sumter. I don't know if you had a yeah, chance I to see it. that Yeah, I saw it. It was photo, really, really that was, very cool. Uh, really cool. Captured the, the essence of this community. I mean, you got people, uh, yes. three generations now, coming here and living and celebrating and participating, which is uh, what we're here to do. And the big one, of course, is Thursday. We have another opening of another recreation center, Franklin. Yay! Yes, it's going to be opening on Thursday, June 22nd at 9 a.m. Come one, come all, and um, explore and meet staff. And uh, we have a great uh, activity schedule planned. Mm -hmm. Uh, We're going to have some, uh, it's going to be themed with some watermelon activities and programs. And also, if you have your grandchildren or children in in the area, uh, come on out and and participate in the grand opening. We have resort style family pool. Uh, we have the putting course. Uh, we have loads of outdoor amenities. We have the most amazing um, activity room with the table shuffleboard. We have billiards, table tennis. Uh, the the game room has just grown exponentially from what we've seen. So cool. I saw I saw the uh, teaser video that the villages put out for Franklin, and I said this place looks amazing. Yep. And I'm all about the watermelon, man. <sighs> We are going to have some uh, watermelon available. We will be also having some, uh, you know, I'm a Florida native, born and raised. Uh, we'll have some boiled peanuts out there and some mm-hmm. lemonade and some country music. And we're actually going to try to do, do you remember the song, The Watermelon Crawl? No. I can't oh, say that I that's do. That's a classic. So we're going to try to line dance to The Watermelon Crawl uh, okay. for our country folks out there. Come on out. We have a line dance instructor that's going to give up, you know, a brief intro how to do it and uh, see how many people can get out there. I would love to see both of you guys do, do a line dance. <laughs> <laughs> it's electric. <laughs> <laughs> it's electric. Water, water, watermelon. Oh. So, yes, we have a great uh, day planned. Uh, then after that, it'll be open uh, from there on out on a regular basis. So, so. Cool. what the festivities start at 9? Nine, 9. And how long does it go for? Right to about 1 o'clock. Okay. Uh, you know, but um, it'll be open the rest of the day. So, um, if you miss it... Um, Come on out anyways, but we want you to be there to celebrate, you know, being part of the ribbon cutting, being the first uh, folks to jump in the swimming pool, to use the courts. That's, that's all pretty. That's exciting. It's really cool. It's, hey, I was out there. I got in the pool first when it opened. Jack, yeah. are you going to go down to Franklin? Just make sure it's after one o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> they might not let you in. I know. <laughs> we'll have a drone flying over you. <laughs> so that's that's the opening. It's going to be a, a great celebration. And if you're not familiar where Franklin is, um, if you go past Sawgrass Grove, where Azell is, and you keep going uh, further south on yep. Megasin, you'll pass Homestead. Yes. And then about a mile down the road, give or it's, take. It's um, right between the village of Newell and the village of Lake Denham. You, you it's wrapped it's, right into that, man. That was perfect. Is that not perfect or what? <laughs> Just, you know, be careful going through the gates at Citrus Grove because they are set to construction mode and don't go flying up to it. Yeah. Don't yeah. be taking the bars down. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Slow and easy, right? That's right. Yes, nice and yes. easy. Yeah, absolutely. And then we had a great event with Yoga on the Square last week. Um, we also have a Fit Club Summer membership that we're doing right now for $100 for three months. Uh, you can sign up for a Fit Club membership and you can use any of the Fit Club locations that we have at our uh, regional oh, rec wow. center. That's so, great. Um, lots of things going on. Camp Village is hitting the third week um, and that's going like gangbusters. So 
Nothing going slow right now in the summer. We no. we are gangbusters right now. And wow, week three on Camp Villages already? Can you believe it? Mm. Yeah. It just seems like we just said it was starting. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. The third week of it, and uh, it's, it's going great. And, uh, yes, come on out, Franklin. Thursday, the 22nd, 9 a.m., uh, watermelon uh, festivities, uh, music, uh, staff will be out there, volunteers, come meet some of our rec folks, um, and uh, come use your brand new amenities. And uh, once again, once we open, it's here to stay forever, which is pretty darn cool. Now cool. I can ask you the question, the the bins that are outside Franklin, that they look like almost like a fruit stand, is that going to be, uh, does it going to have like real watermelon in there or... You know, we're, uh, when we decorative? open a new facility, that's a great question. When we open a new facility, we kind of take organic steps. We let things come organically grow, if that makes uh, exactly. any sense yep. out of it. So we'll we'll definitely be able to use it for some type of programming. And, uh, oh, that's we'll, going to be awesome. That's going to be a great setup. But, uh, yeah, we have a great ad in the paper and, uh, and on information on the website about all the festivities and things to, you're going to experience when you come out there. So come one, come all, and uh, celebrate this grand opening with us. Yeah, and they're always a lot of fun. Every time a new rec center opens up, yeah. it's it's a lot of fun. Yeah. It's exciting. Yes, it is. A lot of energy. Is. Weather looks good. And uh, bring your bathing suit. Or bring your pickleball shorts. Or <laughs> are there such a thing, pickleball shorts? I think there's attire for everything, isn't there? I okay. have no idea. <laughs> Maybe we should get in the pickleball attire. Yeah. Pickle <laughs> <laughs> we'll call it J and J pickleball wear. <laughs> Watch out, Nike. <laughs> All no, right. No key. <laughs> John, Aren't you glad we're not on here for like an hour? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And so that's only like three cups of coffee, too. Uh, always great to see both of Thank you. Thank you, John. Thank you, and uh, we'll see you out at the uh, opening, I hope. Thanks, oh, yeah. John. We'll be down there. Right. We'll come down and say hi. Come on. All Take right. care. See y'all. Push me in the pool. <laughs> All right, bye. There he goes. John Rohan, Director of Recreation and Parks here in the Villages.